everybody? Welcome back to Daily Easy English Expression. Today's expression is probably the finest expression I've ever taught. Uh, it's the best. It's something that all of you can use. Uh, however, it's probably not best for a formal situation. The expression is, he who smelt it, dealt it. Yes. He who smelt it. Now, actually in American English, and I think in Canada, we normally don't say smelt, S-M-E-L-T. We say smelled, S-M-E-L-L-E-D. But for this expression, we do say, smelt. He who smelt it, dealt it. D-E-A-L-T. And once again, dealt, dealed. Now, in America, we do say dealt. D-E-A-L-T. Uh, and we just say deal. Who dealed? D-E-A-L-E-D. -E Both are possible in America. In the UK, smelt, dealt, that's very common, as far as I know. But anyway... Uh, so what does this mean? He who smelt it, dealt it. Alright, so when we talk about dealt, it, it means distribute. And specifically, cards, like poker cards, you know? So let's say we're playing poker, and I give one card, one card, one card, one card, two card, two, 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 two. You get, this is dealing. Dealing. I'm dealing the cards. And after I'm done, I have dealt the cards. I dealt the cards. I gave out the cards. I distributed the cards. I whom gave the cards. He who smelt it dealt it. Now, the key word in this expression is it. I-T, not information technology. No, no, no. Actually, information biology. <laughs> it refers to flatulence, cutting the cheese, those sounds that barking spiders make, farting. <laughs> now, sometimes when a person farts, it's silent. Right? Yeah, I mean, you know, if I'm sitting here and you know that I delivered the gas. But sometimes there's no sound. And then suddenly your nose realizes, oh my God, right? Something horrible has just happened. Somebody in this room farted. Somebody dealt a fart. Oh man, who farted, man? And this is what we say. And the response is, he who smelt it, dealt it. The first person who smells the fart, farted. That's the idea. But smelt and dealt sound beautiful. I want you to check out the dialogue. happens. Those evil people. And, you know, let's, let's be honest. If you have done some, if you have created a biological hazard, you should warn your friends. Hey, everybody. Hey, everybody in the office. I want you to know that there's a biological hazard coming towards you. You should leave now. Say something before the person next to you says, Did you? But of course, if they accuse you and you, you are innocent, you can always say, He who smelt it, dealt it. And even if you're guilty, but you don't want people to know you did it, you can still say, He who smelt it, dealt it. <laughs> yeah. 
By the way, uh, March 17th, St. Patrick's Day. They say that drinking beer, eating corned beef and cabbage and carrots, these things will give you gas. <laughs> well, I'm Irish. Well, 25% Irish. And tomorrow I will be enjoying an Irish meal, of course, with beer. So I'll tell you uh, how my gas level is. And don't worry, this is YouTube. It's a video. Uh, it's, you'll be fine. Uh, I pity the person who lives with me. My poor cats. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I better go. Uh, that's it. Have a great day. If you're Irish, why would you be watching this video? But anyway, if you're Irish, happy St. Patrick's Day, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye-bye. Smelt it, dealt it. <laughs>